We begin here on KGW News at 4 with a shooting near the Clackamas Town Center. One person is dead after being shot and killed by a police officer. Today, workers at the Lazy Boy Furniture Store along Southwest 82nd Avenue were cleaning up broken glass from the gunshots. While the investigation is still going on, workers at nearby businesses are shaken up over what happened. Blair Best is in the newsroom for us. Blair, what more can you tell us? Brittany, the details we have at this point are limited and police aren't saying who the victim is until the family is notified. Today, we were out where it happened off a busy stretch of Southeast 82nd, where several nearby businesses were feeling the effects of the shooting. It was a chaotic morning inside Lazy Boy Furniture as staff cleaned debris and detectives searched for bullets from a deadly shooting hours earlier that happened just steps away from their front door. A sale flyer now covers this large bullet hole in the store's front window. It all started around 11 o'clock Monday night when Portland police and Clackamas County deputies were chasing a person believed to be involved in a Portland homicide. This video sent to us by a viewer shows the end of that chase on this section of Southeast 82nd Avenue and when officers approached the victim who appears to be inside a car. Now it was at this point the police say they shot and killed the suspect. It's unclear if the victim had a gun or shot at the officers. That's scary. I mean, that's that's really close to home. Um, it's just scary. Lyman Hyder runs a nearby gym, one he opened in Clackamas County to try and avoid being around violence like this. It's unfortunate. I mean, it's you just hear a lot of it. So, I mean, I was actually kind of surprised that an officer was involved and we have officers that work out here and um, but it was surprised just to kind of hear it so close. A concern that was top of mind for other nearby businesses as well. Just super scary to think about that. It was just uh, so close to work and we were like odds of that happening just turning the other way. That could have been us. Now, people are definitely rattled in that area, but not surprised to hear of another deadly shooting. The officers involved have been placed on paid administrative leave and we're still waiting on more information on what led up to the shooting. Brittany, and we know you'll keep us up to date. Blair, thank you.